You've seen zombies in the media, but while many of these portrayals rely on at least some aspect of magic, necromancy, or a pathogen born of biological fantasy, I am here to present the truth as I have observed it. Zombism is caused by what I have termed the human zombic virus, and it is made even more disturbing by its insidious nature. After a time of flu-like symptoms, HZV causes its victims to fall into a fitful coma. After this, nearly all metabolic function is sharply reduced for a period of up to roughly two hours, and it often appears that the victim has died. Indeed, the heart does cease to beat, and it never resumes. But how could it a technically living creature begin to decompose and even go on living without a functioning heart. Once the heart arrests, both the nervous and circulatory systems are drastically restructured. First, by a mechanism as yet unknown to me, the nervous system appears to proliferate, strengthening pathways and innervating muscle to a level not seen in the uninfected human. Second, skeletal muscle assumes the role relinquished by the arrested heart, rhythmically contracting and relaxing. All of these changes and many more lead to the transformation of a victim into a hunting machine and with a single-minded purpose. Locate prey, capture prey, and feed.